Good design is good business. We begin part three of our tour of Farina by asking the architect about the lessons learned from his first restaurant project. Lessons learned. Acoustics. We had originally dedicated this entire soffit area for acoustic treatment and um, there were a lot of voices in the mix and uh, who convinced me that because of the, the exposed wooden rafters that there would be enough disruption to, to the sound waves that it wouldn't be an acoustic problem in the space. But in actuality, as with most restaurants in San Francisco, it's a very lively space. And when we're at full capacity, it's very difficult to hear um, the person sitting next to you. Another lesson learned has to do with the weight of tables. This is an extremely heavy table. It's custom designed. Um, the plate at the bottom is uh, it's a half inch plate. It's a solid rod stem for the table and extremely heavy and difficult to move around, uh, which is of critical importance in a restaurant when you have clients, um, 100, 120 clients seeing the restaurant, you need to move uh, furniture around quite quickly and nimbly. Any advice, Brett, for other architects embarking on their first restaurant project? As much as you can, do upfront research into the requirements for gas and electric. Um, we underestimated um, the amount of effort that was required and space required to coordinate that. Secondly, I would say really think about circulation because if, if a restaurant does not circulate well, then I think that you productivity of the staff is decreased and it becomes a real issue in terms of profitability.